Hey, this is Nick from FitStep.com, PowerfulTrainingSecrets.com. I got a great bicep training tip for you here today. This one is for the standing barbell curl. One of the things I see people tend to do when doing barbell curls is they have the weight and they keep on continuously leaning forward, which obviously gives you an advantage, tends to lead to cheating and cheat curls, take some of the stress off your biceps. The trick I'm going to show you here today is going to really make an honest curler out of you. Because basically on every single rep, you're going to be taking that bar, pulling it back against your thighs, which basically trying to force your shoulder blades back. Once you're in that back position, then you're going to do a strict curl, rather than letting your shoulders hunch forward, which gives you more mechanical advantage, which makes you be able to curl that much more weight. So it looks impressive, but you're not going to build great biceps that way. This technique is going to force you to stay honest. So I'll give you a demo here. And I'm only using 65 pounds on this bar because when you're doing this right, that's all you really need. So I recommend chopping at least 30 pounds off what you generally do for curls because you're going to be doing them a lot more strictly. So you want to take a grip that is just a little outside your body weight. You don't want your hands to be hitting the, the uh, thighs on this one. So bend your knees a little bit. You can see on this first rep, here's the general position you see people in. You're going to do that. Basically pulling that bar against your thighs, almost like you're trying to row it against your body. That pulls your shoulders back, and then you're going to do a strict curl from there. And you're going to repeat that on every rep. So as you can see, as I come to the bottom, there's that tendency to pull forward. And that's just natural. Most people don't correct it. So at the bottom, you're going to correct it. So as you can see, it makes it a lot tougher when you're doing this. And on every rep, that tendency is to kind of pull forward. So you're going to pull back, pull your shoulders back, and set them down. So you're basically locking them back in, so that forces them back into that proper position. The most strict curl possible. So I'm going to do a few more reps here. When you do them strictly, they're a lot more painful than when you're doing them with a lot of body momentum and a lot of swing. I can promise you when you do these for real, your weights will go down, but your bicep growth will take a big shot for the better because biceps really thrive on that tension. And most people do not do it right. So next time you're doing your bicep training, I promise you give that technique a try, you're going to feel it to a whole new level. If you haven't done barbell curves in a while, because you don't feel them very well, that's going to get you feeling them very well again. So definitely one worth giving a try.